Hi guys, welcome back for another speed racing video. If you are new to the channel please consider to subscribe and those who already subscribed to my channel thank you so much. It means a lot. So today's video, it's all about vegan aka herbivore animal speed races, this category contains all animals that generally eat plant matter, European fallow deer, Indian elephant, Malayan tapir, southern white rhinoceros and the wild water buffalo. Let the race begin. The European fallow deer, or dama dama, is an ungulate found in grasslands and woodlands throughout Europe. The coat is tan with rows of white spots on the body, with a pale underside and throat, although there are various morphs such as leucism, white, melanism, black, and menal, paler coat without tail markings, occurring in European fallow deer as well. Males, called bucks, have large palmate antlers which span an average length of 60 cm when fully developed, whereas females, called does, do not. Bucks are larger than does, with a head body length of 1.4 m to 1.6 m and shoulder height of 0.85 m to 0.95 m, while the does are 1.3 m to 1.5 m long with a shoulder height of 0.75 m to 0.85 m. Native to both Central and Southeast Asia, the Indian or Asian elephant, or Elephas maximus indicus, is a species distinguishable by a distinctive tusk, small ears, and gray skin with pink modeling around the face. They are smaller than their African counterparts, with males reaching an average height of 2.75 m and weighing 4,000 kg, compared to the female average of 2.49 m and 2,400 kg. They are large herbivores and live in a variety of different environments, including forests, grasslands and mountains, wherein they feed on tree leaves, bark and grasses. The Malayan tapir is a mammal native to rainforests of Southeast Asia. The Malayan tapir's head, shoulders, front legs and back legs are black, and their mid-body and back end is white. It is a heavy-set animal and has a distinctive, prehensile proboscis nose. Malayan tapirs measure between 1.8 and 2.5 m in length and weight between 250 and 540 kilograms. Females tend to be slightly larger than males and 10% to 20% heavier. Malayan tapirs are endangered. The main threat towards this species is habitat loss through deforestation and the conversion of land for agricultural use. They are a protected species in Malaysia and Indonesia. The southern white rhinoceros is a large species of ungulate native to southern Africa, South Africa, Namibia, Zimbabwe, Kenya, Uganda, Zambia. They are large, broad animals with thick, gray skin. The southern white rhinoceros has two horns, with the front horn being much longer than the secondary horn. The head of the rhinoceros is almost rectangular in shape with a square snout. They have protuberant ears on the top of the musculature that supports the head. Male southern white rhinoceros measure between 12, 21 feet and 13 feet in length are 68 and 75 inches tall and weigh an average of 5,060 pounds if females measure between 11, 22 feet and 12,045 feet in length are 64 inches to 70 inches tall and weigh an average of 3,740 pounds.
The wild water buffalo, or Bubalus arni, also known as the Asian water buffalo, is a very large species of bovine living in the marshes, swamps and floodplains of Central East and Southeast Asia. Its present range is extremely fragmented, with the majority of animals living in India and other populations surviving in Nepal, Bhutan, Thailand, and Cambodia. Wild water buffaloes have gray to black skin, with coarse dark hair covering the body sparsely, and an elongated head with small ears. Both sexes carry large, distinctively curved horns that point out horizontally from the skull and can have a span of 2M, though the horns of bulls can be larger than those of cows. Bulls measured between 2.4M and 3M in length, stand 1.5M to 1.9M tall at the shoulder and weigh up to 1,200 kg. Cows are about two-thirds the size of males, at 1.8M to 2.25M long, 1.13M to 1.43M tall at the shoulder and weighing up to 800 kg. And the winner is the European fallow deer. European fallow deers have excellent eyesight and hearing and can detect very slight movements in their surroundings which helps them avoid predation. The antlers of the European fallow deer can be up to 60 centimeters long and are shed every year. A fallow deer fawn can start walking 30 minutes after birth. While the antlers of the European fallow deer are growing, they are covered in velvet. When growth is complete, the velvet is shed and antlers may temporarily have a tattered appearance. While a species of fallow deer was native to Europe before the last ice age, the European fallow deer is thought to be native to Turkey, Italy, and Greece. It is suspected the Romans spread this species throughout the continent during their rule. Nowadays European fallow deer have been introduced to countries around the world. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Ich habe noch gerade gelernt, da klingt hier jetzt sogar.